Lesson 26, Applications of De Marvel's Theorem number 7. But by using the modulus argument form, express uh, 1 minus i root 3 to power 3 divided by 1 plus i all squared in the form of x plus i y. Now what I'll do here, we'll let z1 equal 1 minus i root 3. And we'll put that into the mod arg form. So over here I've got a 1 here. Then we go down to a root 3 here. So clearly r will be equal to the square root of 1 plus 3, which is 2. So it's 2. And here we can see that the angle here is going to be equal to minus pi upon 3. So this is equal to 2 cis of minus pi upon 3. Now, z, uh, this z1 is cubed, so we'll write that as z1 all cubed, and cubing that we'll get, cubing the 2 we'll get the 8, and this will be the cis of minus pi. Okay, now z2 equals 1 plus i. Fairly easy little one to work out. That's 1, 1, root 2 is your modulus, and pi upon 4 is your argument. So this becomes root 2, c is pi upon 4. And we square that, we get 2, c is pi upon 2. Therefore, we divide these two, z1, cubed over z2 squared which that equals 8 says minus pi over 2 says pi upon 2 okay dividing these we get 4 and subtracting the arguments we're going to get that to be equal to um, three pi minus three pi upon two. Now this minus three pi upon two, going this way, is really pi upon two. So it's four. This is pi upon two. Okay, and that is the cos of pi upon two plus i sine pi upon 2, the cos of pi upon 2 is 0, the sine of pi upon 2 is 1, so that gives the result of 4i.